cross cradle position is a great position for newborn babies. It's very similar to the cradle position, but you switch arms, which allows you to support your baby more with the, with the opposite arm that they're nursing on, which allows you to have more flexibility with shaping the breast to allow for a more deep latch. In order to do this position, you position the baby in your arm like this, and you cradle the back of their neck with your finger and your index finger like that. That, you don't want to press on their head because that can make it hard for them to latch as well as result in more pain for you. So you just want to hold the baby with your forearm, have them cradled in your forearm like this. And then you want to hold their neck and with, as I said, with your finger, with your thumb and your index finger. The point of this position is to allow your baby to raise their neck up high enough and to be able to get a good deep latch. A lot of moms are able to successfully do this latch without any type of pillows or any type of support that way, but if you feel more comfortable, you can definitely put a pillow. I would probably put it under this side and not necessarily over here, just because that can allow you to kind of put your baby's head up a little bit higher. As with the cradle position, you want to make sure that your baby's lips and nose are really in line with your nipple. You don't want to have to be leaning over or backwards or any type of extra. You don't want to have to be leaning over or backwards in order to get your baby to latch. Just as an overview, this is what the cross cradle position is probably going to look like for you. Again, you cradle your baby in your arm like this and you support them with your forearm and your fingers and you support their neck. And you make sure that they're in line with your breast and you can shape it with the C hold or U hold or whatever you find most comfortable for shaping your breast to help your baby latch. Be sure to subscribe below for more breastfeeding videos and for more breastfeeding support, head to the breastfeedingmama.com. We have a lot of free resources as well as in-depth online and on-demand breastfeeding courses.